This great stone circle, known as Meini Hirion, was put in place by ancient peoples 4,000 years ago. At 400 meters above sea level, it was thought to have had great spiritual significance and is known today as the Druid Circle. Constructed on the site of a prehistoric pathway from east to west and with several other tracks running close by, it certainly feels like a crossroads. There's also a practical significance to this area. The nearby rock of Penman Maur was ideal for making hafted stone axes over 5,000 years ago. The rock would be flaked and polished into a suitable blade and then bound to a wooden handle. These axes were prized possessions, being symbols of authority and identity, which were passed down through the generations. At nearby Great Orm, the rocky landscape was to throw up an even greater discovery. It was beneath this limestone headland nearly 4,000 years ago that people discovered the remarkable properties of copper. This copper ore, when combined with tin, could be smelted and forged into bronze tools and weapons, a huge breakthrough in human technology. It's hard to imagine how this vast cavern was dug out by miners using nothing more than bone and stone tools, and all this over 4,000 years ago. The mines of the Great Orm are of global historical significance. Most of these tunnels have only been uncovered since the late 1980s. But in that time, they've revealed a huge amount about how our ancestors drew on these rich veins of ore below ground. It was to change the world above forever. The discovery of copper was followed later by iron. But as these people began to utilize the land, the climate of this area changed in a dramatic way. Rainfall rose and temperatures fell. Gathering, hunting, or growing enough food for everyone became a real struggle. With conflict over land and precious resources, Treyr Cairi's high walls are testament to an unstable time. This remarkable Iron Age hill fort with walls as high as four meters provided shelter and protection to around 150 stone houses.